Hello and welcome to the 2018 Seattle Worldwide Industry Career Expo. My name is Arnold James and I'm the Director of Career Services for Embry-Riddle Worldwide Campus. We're here connecting our students and graduates and even military veterans with our industry leading employers. We are here to make a difference in, in their careers and we are hopefully that you will join us at our next event. Please feel free to contact us with the information below and we look forward to seeing you at our next event. So the National Oceanic Atmospheric Administration Officer Corps looks for people who are really looking to get down with an adventure and wants to explore. We offer a variety of opportunities in math, science and engineering and primarily we are looking for people who are willing to move around for every two to three years, uh, willing to go out to sea or fly aircraft and serve their country. Well, we work for Naval Industry Warfare Center Keyport, Washington, which is a Department of Defense industry uh, group. And we're looking for engineers, science and technology, uh, and data sciences uh, for the betterment of the fleet. Uh, we build and maintain systems for the U.S. Navy. Uh, we're the civilian component of the Navy, uh, non-uniformed, and we're responsible for torpedo systems as well as submarines and emerging technologies. So the jobs that we're looking for, the, the career positions we're looking to fill, really span the spectrum of what Embry-Riddle offers. We're looking for engineering, sciences, data, and as well as the administrative technical program managers, and uh, operations management. So my name is April Erickson. I'm the Seattle-based chief pilot for Horizon Air. So clearly we're looking for pilots and um, in the aviation field there's a lot of different opportunities once you start as a pilot. We have recruiting pilot opportunities, training department, check airmen, safety. So once you become a pilot at Horizon Air, kind of from there there's a lot of different career paths. Fun fact, when I, uh, I was a student at Embry-Riddle in Daytona Beach and I was an intern for Horizon Air when I was in school there, got familiar with the company and uh, once I built up my time as a flight instructor, I was able to get a job there about seven years ago. So I love representing Embry-Riddle at Horizon Air and Alaska Air Group as a whole. And so it's a great opportunity to come to these events and see other students because I like to remind them that, hey, when I started I had 20 hours of flight time on my resume and there's so many opportunities out there for you to do in the future, so. Old Republic, actually about probably 20% of our company are Embry-Riddle graduates. We're about 200 people for a company, so small compared to others, but uh, some of our high upper management are Embry-Riddle. I got the job by being a Riddle graduate. It kind of fell into my lap, because no one thinks of insurance, but he heard Riddle graduate, that's what he was looking for. Someone else was a Riddle graduate, and all the things lined up and here I am now. Aviation Technical Services actually attended the Embry-Riddle event job fair that we did last year and we received an apprentice mechanic hire out of that so he had an aerospace background and we were happy to have him join us. We are Express Jet Airlines and yes we have had uh, very successful recruiting events with Embry-Riddle. We've been to Daytona a couple of times here at Worldwide in Seattle. Um, a lot of our pilots including our recruiters and our uh, hiring manager are all alumna from uh, Embry-Riddle. Um, Panasonic Avionics is an interesting um, uh, opportunity because we are a subset standalone company within the Panasonic family. There's actually 13 Panasonic families in total of which Panasonic Avionics is one and a lot of people that we hire here at Embry-Riddle and we're always excited to attend the job fair are the aviation mechanics so we're doing that maintenance while the product is in service right there shoulder to shoulder with um, the uh, mechanics from the airlines. We have engineers, they're doing both retrofits, they're doing um, design of new products, both software engineers, hardware engineers, field engineers embedded with our customers. Um, and then we have um, a, a wide breadth of what you can do with Panasonic beyond that. Um, as a global company that has um, many sister companies, we frequently pull that talent from other companies and then we also see people who are rising stars in our company move on to management positions within um, all of those sister companies. So there is an interesting scenario where Panasonic, you can have a full or many careers within the Panasonic organization. Um, at SkyWest Airlines, we are currently um, seeking qualified candidates to work in uh, our flight operations as pilots, flight attendants, um, and mechanics. 
um, as well as at our headquarters in St. George, Utah for marketing, IT, basically anything you can think of that you'd find in a you know, larger company. Uh, so we, there's a strong presence of, of Emory-Riddle students that are already at SkyWest. Uh, we know that their training is, is fantastic uh, at the college there. And, uh, and that translates well to, to our industry. So uh, Exojet is a Part 135 on-demand private charter company. Um, we have a wide variety of positions that are available right now, ranging from pilots to customer service uh, specialists to flight operations analysts, um, AMP mechanics, uh, quality assurance inspectors. Exojet has a ton of um, uh, Embry-Riddle alums. We've got pilots, we've got sales advisors, We've got uh, international flight planners, uh, we've got client services specialists, we've got uh, even one of our assistant chief pilots right now started as uh, an Embry or is an Embry Riddle alum and has worked his way through um, as a line pilot to uh, a flight man uh, operations manager to now assistant chief pilot. So we've got a ton, ton of uh, Embry Riddle alums and a lot of opportunities for them.